my lab, the Healthy Development Lab here at Rutgers, um, we study body image and the development of eating behaviors. Currently, we're interested in understanding how romantic partners influence individuals' eating behaviors and the development of body image and even obesity risk. So the research that we do looks at romantic relationships and the impact on body image of the individual. So we had couples come in and fill out surveys in the lab and we also measured their height and weight. Um, and what we looked at was how, a part, how your romantic partner's weight affected your own body image and the way that you felt about your body. Understanding how gender and sexuality and our interpersonal relationships affect the way we feel about our bodies can really have a positive impact on many people, especially since we live in a society that's so focused on appearance and weight. So the study here was a replication that was originally done on heterosexual couples to explore how women's partner influenced their own body image. This study was done on lesbian couples to see if the influence of the gender of the partner affected women's body image in a different way. So understanding how people eat, how they feel about their bodies, how concerned they are about their weight, um, how other people in their lives might influence all of these things I think is really important because right now our eating habits essentially are one of the most deadly problems we have in this country. This research has impacted my student life because it allows me to take the material that our teachers cover in our courses and apply it to a real life research setting. Um, Jen and Gianna have been involved in every step of the research process in this lab. They've been involved in helping us to plan some of the studies we've done, um, all the way through to being able to present some of the research at conferences this past year. Since my involvement in this lab, not only has my knowledge of psychology research expanded dramatically, but I've also gained a genuine interest in the field. Um, now I am planning to pursue graduate school in the fall and hopefully become a psychology researcher and professor myself one day. I think these hands-on experiences in the lab are really helpful for undergraduates like Jenna and Gianna to help to figure out their own career paths. Um, not only does it give them actual research expertise, but it also helps them to figure out if this is the sort of thing they'd like to do as a career, um, and if not, then what other um, careers in the field might be more appealing to them. Okay.